Okay guys, what is going on? It's Brandon here, back with another video. I hope you guys are having an amazing day. First of all, I just want to say thank you guys so much for all the support on the 100,000 step challenge. Really means a lot to me. Getting like 25 new sub subscribers, which is absolutely insane. And uh, yeah, it's like my most viewed video on my channel. So hey, that's a plus. I mean, I only went through 16 hours of torture, but that's besides the point, right? Anyways, I want to address why I'm not, I haven't been like making videos recently and uh, where I've really been. Well, first of all, as you can probably tell, I'm in a, uh, a different room, AKA I moved. Um, so I took probably like two weeks off from filming because I just had to get adjusted, you know? Second of all, I kind of just needed a break. I've literally been grinding so much this year. Literally, like it, it's kind of insane how much work I put in. Literally, I, I pretty much haven't missed a week besides the four weeks that I've already missed taking my break now. And I actually feel pretty rejuvenated, except for one thing. But before we do get into that, uh, yeah, let's just keep Okay guys, I just got a uh, pre-workout from Dunkin' Donuts. Their coffee is extremely cheap and it's actually like really, really good. At first, I didn't think it was that good, but it's actually pretty fire. I think I like prefer it over like Starbucks's and stuff. So anyways, I'm um, gonna drink this up as a pre-workout and then I'll see you guys in the gym. All my life I've barely spoken. Your words have been so broken. I've been under your hypnosis. Why did I sip that potion? I'm so done with holy ghosting. My birth, it is an omen. Lay me down up in the ocean until you see no motion. Right now I can barely focus. Wait, wait, wait. This is the main reason why I haven't uploaded in a month. Okay, guys, the main reason why I haven't uploaded at all in the last month is pretty much because uh well okay so to understand this fully kind of have to go back before the 100,000 step challenge a few days before and uh yeah I kind of got hurt so not my proudest moment but so what happened was I was squatting with my friend and the bar kind of slipped down my uh slipped down my back I'd pick it up kind of felt like not a pop but like a poking feeling and then I racked it and it didn't really feel that good. So uh, I kind of stopped working out, did the 100,000 step challenge back. I thought was fine because then after the 100,000 step challenge, I stopped working out for like three days, took three days off, got back in the gym. It was still bothering me. So went to the doctor. Apparently I had sprained my back and I thought that uh, just taking a week off be totally fine took a, like four or five days off probably should have taken that week off and uh yeah it still hadn't gotten better um then i pretty much just like kept probably last 30 days maybe lifted like five times just to see how my back is feeling and yeah it doesn't really feel the greatest went back to the doctor and uh yeah i have to do physical therapy for who knows long how for who knows how long, probably going to be three to four weeks at the minimum. This guy, it, it really does suck. And uh, yeah, I'm just kind of mad at myself because the main reason why I haven't been uploading is because I haven't lifted and worked out for, it's probably been like three good weeks since I trained, last trained, which really sucks. My doctor said that the only thing that I can do is uh, like walk and uh, I can't like do anything that like really breaks a sweat. It's just so that, that like I don't do any activities that hurt my back even more. And I think the best thing to do now is to really just rest it. So this means that I literally like won't be able to lift at all, which is really sad. Been going crazy just out of my mind, just not knowing what to do. I'm so bored, antsy, you know, just cause I haven't lifted, you know, and I know I'm like addicted to lifting, so it, it really does suck. I really wish that I hadn't hurt myself. And the thing is, when I when I was squatting that day, I wasn't even supposed to squat. I was actually supposed to deadlift. So I was, I'm kind of mad at myself that I made the wrong choice and didn't go with my programming. 
because I wouldn't be thought that I am with a sprain back if I actually followed my programming and didn't work out like do the same workout with as with my friends. So it, I guess it is what it is, but I mean, it, it really it's 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 unfortunate, right? But I mean, I do think that this t taught me a valuable lesson where I, I I should be training harder than last time, but I guess I'm just not training as smart as I should be and how like lifting too much weight can actually be severe on my joints and my back. And uh, the doctor actually said that my injury is mostly because I'm lifting too often and like I'm just overdoing it in the uh, weight room. So, I mean, I guess that's not a bad thing where I just like I'm addicted to being healthy and lifting and trying to better myself, but it does suck. It, it, it really is unfortunate and it, I'm going to miss working out but I start physical therapy June 30th right now it's June's 22nd and hopefully it's not super bad and, and I definitely will be doing the stretches that the physical therapist gives me at home 100% and maybe even more uh, just because I want to uh, get healthy quicker to get back in the weight room but when I go back into the weight room I'm not going to be training as hard as I was before. I'm going to take it nice and easy because I've got all of my life to train. There's no reason why I should really just push myself as hard as I possibly can every single day and get hurt and not be able to lift the rest of my life. Lifting should be a lifetime thing. It shouldn't just be something that you do for three years and then you get hurt and you can't like walk ever again or whatever like that. Hopefully that doesn't happen to me. And yeah, I just really should be smarter with how I train, not not lift as heavy, really just focus on my form more. And uh, yeah, that's really it. So with that being said, I hope you guys did enjoy this the sad informational type video. But uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, um, share this video with all your friends. Yeah, I'm going to still, I'm going to start uploading again. I'll probably have to change my content to. Uh, from working out to getting better like you know but might want to start a new series on like back to basics or whatever like that just trying to get back in my rhythm of getting healthy again so uh and fixing this injury so yeah thanks for watching and i'll see you guys next time peace out Bye.